Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to continue restoring this old Miller's Falls Tools hand plane. I'm really excited to continue working on this project, so let's get right into it. In the previous video, you saw me dissect this hand. Other humans. In the previous video, you saw me dissect this hand plane. So what I've decided to tackle first is removing the rust. So the bottom of the plane needs to be perfectly flat. Now the way I'm going to achieve that is by taking some spray adhesive and applying it to this piece of sandpaper and then sticking that piece of sandpaper onto this piece of plate glass that I've determined is flat enough for my liking. I'm just going to apply a nice even coat onto the sandpaper to let that dry for a couple minutes. So while that is drying, I thought I'd let you in on some exciting news that I have. Soon I'll be taking up a student just for them to learn some very basic woodworking skills and I'm going to help them make some picture frames. So that's going to be very exciting for me, and maybe for you guys, if you want to get inspired to start woodworking. So the glue is nice and tacky now. Now apply it to the glass. Right. Try and line this up pretty evenly so I don't have to sacrifice too much sandpaper. There we go. Now, you just press it on. So what I have been doing for a little while now is taking this uh, spray bottle full of soapy water, just spraying the sandpaper on the glass, just working on flattening. So I have been grinding bottom of this plane for about maybe 15 minutes now and I've gotten it pretty much perfectly flat. All I'm going to work on now is getting out the couple bits of rust that are left and then I'm going to move on to the sides. of restoring the Miller's Falls Tools hand plane. In this episode, we removed all the rust and flattened the bottom of the plane and removed the rust from the sides. Next episode, I will be restoring the iron of the hand plane. I will be flattening it, removing all the rust, as well as sharpening it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.